Welcome back. Today it's Showcase Sunday, and today we take a look at Beta SVK and a preview of one of his new ships that he's working on. <gasps> what is it? All right, so as I mentioned, we're taking a look at Builder SVK's builds. Uh, he only has a few, but he is letting me preview an awesome ship that he's working on. This is not it. This is already done. This is the Hercules tugboat, and we're also going to take a look at the RH-25 Lucky. And then we're going to take a look at something he's been working on for some time. And oh my god, it's cool. So we're going to go find it. Right now it's not here anywhere. I can't see it. But we're going to take a look at this tugboat. So let's go ahead and do a little tour. So I have not been on this ship before, but it's got doors to get on. Uh, there we go. I just climbed up that ladder. And of course, back here we have something that I have to take a look at. And it is a fuel port, I guess. Uh, a lot of nice detail on this ship. I'm going to go ahead and look on the outside after I look around, but we have a nice little winch here. Oh, it's a big winch. And then we have our, what looks like a medic door. And nice little graphics here. And we've got our stuff. And, ooh, we go down. And we have the engine room. And then, oh, what? Another one. What is this? What is this? I, I want to see what this is. Uh, hmm. I don't know what that is. So the engines are off right now. I don't want to touch those. But I am, oh. Maybe that's just a cool stairwell. Hmm. Okay. I thought that was a door, the way these ladders look. Does it look like a door? It looks like a door. Oh, well. Uh, let's go ahead and see what this does. Heater. Got gener... Oh, is this where you turn on the engines down here? Oh, let's do that. Battery on. Uh, engine, 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 engine. Oh, wait. Fuel. Oh, in wait. Fuel pump. Oh, okay. Oh, look at the lights. Okay. Engine starter. Engine starter. That's actually a generator. All right, so that's looking good. We got this started without much trouble. I am very happy with myself. What's that do? Oh, it's a light. Okay, so we're going to go back up now that we've got the engines running for the first time in history without much trouble. Got a nice little shelf here. Um, a restroom. A little kitchen. Nice little eating area here. And what's this do? Opens this up. And we have a nice little bedroom. Oh, this is a nice little boat. Okay, let's go up here. And, uh, oh, now we're on the bridge. Aha! Uh -huh. And let's go in the front and check that out. Wow. Okay, very nice looking little boat. So, let's see. Let's open the door so we have fresh air. Alright, so now we are here and we have... What? Oh, well, this is interesting. So I started up down there, but apparently you can start everything up here as well. So, that's a little bit odd that it thinks that it's off, but it's on. So, hmm, interesting. I guess we're good to go. So, unlock the azimuth thruster. Okay. Azimuth. Azimuth. Az azimuth. How do you say that word? Azimuth. Azimuth? I don't know. Azimuth. Okay. Spotlight. Backlight. Clutch and throttle. Okay. We need the clutch, right? Okay. I always put too much throttle and just doesn't like it. Kind of have to start off slow. But here is the outside of the boat. And it's very nice. I like the tires on the side. The nice colors. Oh, look, there's the azimuth. The azimuth. Ah, azimuth. Whatever. You know what I mean. Azimuth. All right, so we're just going to take a little bit of a tour right here. It is just a nice looking little boat. And this is called, again, the Hercules tugboat. And you can get that on the uh, workshop. So I'm going to just go ahead and see if I can beach it. And then we're going to go ahead and take a look at a helicopter and fly over to the big secret preview. That is probably on the thumbnail, so it's not really a secret. But... You know, all right, I'm going to go ahead and pump this all the way up. Oh, there we go. You can do it without stalling. Usually I stall these things. Okay. Very cool. All right, so we're going to go back over here and beach it because I have no idea why. But that's what I'm going to do. But this is a lovely boat. This looks like a career mode kind of boat to have. All right, we're going to beach it, but then we're going to make it disappear. Watch. Oh, it even has a little warning sound. Like warning. You're like shallow. All right, so this is the RH-25, also known as Lucky. You can see it has a four-leaf clover there on the back. And uh, it is a very nice-looking helicopter. Very clean, nicely laid out uh, color scheme and uh, details. It's ready for rescue, and it is named Lucky, so it is all there. So this is the helicopter we are going to use to go find the project that he's working on. I know, I'm building it up. I am building it up because it is amazing. I have just had a glimpse of it so far, 
and it wows me. So I am really excited that Beta was nice enough to give me a copy of the mission so that I could go check it out. And uh, that's what we're going to do. So let's check out this thing, and then we'll head out over into the ocean somewhere. I have no idea where it's at. All right, so first off, we're just going to open this, and nice doors. Look at that. That's cool. And then we're going to go ahead and come inside and shut the windows. Okay, let's turn on some lights in here with my own light. And take a look. We have some parachutes, which the way I fly is probably useful. Got a lot of groundwork. Look at that. So if you look at this floor, this is a really nice job of having detail. A lot of helicopters, military, and probably just civilian helicopters do have a lot of floor panels in the back when they're big like this. And this just looks great. It looks like you can actually open these all up, and there's pipes under there and wires and who knows what. But it looks great. And uh, we have some nice wall art. This is just basically a work of art already. So I don't know where we're going, but we're going to go ahead and fly this over to what he's working on now. And this is a preview. It's so exciting. Okay, let's see if we can get this started. I know. It's me. But we're going to go with what we know here and try to turn on the starter. Starter. Start now. Okay. Battery. Battery! Starter. All right, so we've got that starting. We have auto hover, which is very useful to me. Starting to get its helicopter rotor rolling now. Rolling. Rotoring. Spinning. Spinning up. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay. Oh, let's up that a little bit. Is it going faster? No. What am I forgetting? Ooh, that's... Look at that. That's a neat idea. Uh, okay. Altitude hold. Position lights. Interior lights. Oh, that's useful. Okay. What am I missing here? Oh. Oh, throttle up. Maybe you have to do here? That's oh, the same one. He has it on the pilot seat. You know I love that. So we go up and down here. But, okay, let's... Pump it up a little bit more, I guess. Why are we not moving? What am I forgetting? Oh. Oh, wait. Is there another one over here? What's this? Fuel pump. Oh! Alright. Does this have an autopilot? Because I suck at flying. It does have altitude hold. All right, well, we're just going to have to go with my piloting skills. And it looks like we're going over there. All right, let's go ahead and start moving forward, hopefully. I don't know when I should change gears. Oh, gear up. Ha! Huh? Not gears. Gears. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Why are we not going up? Where's the collective? Is it on the arrow keys? It is on the arrow keys. It's just not labeled. Okay, no problem. All right, so we are going that direction. And what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and fly over there. And whoa! No. No, don't do that. Don't do that. All right, let's go a little bit higher here. A little more arrow keys. So while we're going that direction, I wanted to go ahead and have a talk with you. You know, we haven't been seeing each other lately. We've been seeing a lot of spotlights. And uh, I just wanted to address that the reason there's been a lot of spotlights last week is because I'm working on the B-17 and the B-17 mission. And so I've been trying to get that done, and so I was able to film a lot of the spotlights and go ahead and use them during the week uh, to fill in for my videos that are, you know, I usually have a lot of different videos during the week, but I use the spotlights so that I could get more done on the B-17, and so, you know, that is why you've been seeing a lot of spotlights. Oh my god, I'm in a crash! So let's go ahead and head over here, and I just want to let you know that there will be some new videos besides spotlights coming out. But I really want to get the B-17 done. So, let's go ahead and... Oh, God, I can't fly this thing. Let's go ahead and get over to the uh, the secret ship over here at the LZ. Oh, that is far. Am I going to be able to make it? All right, so we are starting to load the vehicle. So, I am getting excited. Should be popping into view any second now. And uh, it is worth noting that this is not an advanced vehicle. But uh, it is a normal mode, arcade mode, whatever you want to call it. And I guess he'll convert it later. But uh, it's very cool, nevertheless. And hopefully... Crap, it just crashed. So the game crashed when we were getting close to it. It was trying to load it, and it just crashed. So I don't know. We're going to try to get over there again. I just busted my tail. Oh! Oh, uh, boy. Oh, boy. All right. Well, I don't even know if this flies, but it seems like a decent plane that might be able to get there without a problem. Uh, I don't I don't see anything yet. Hmm. 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 Ah, I crashed again. All right. Let's go. This is my kind of my go-to uh whatever you want to call it. My go-to exploring area. I don't want to do that for. Uh go to exploring area type of vehicle and this is by Billy Bly or Billy Bleach or Billy Blage but I think it's Billy Bly and uh, 
This is the thing I love to use when I need to get somewhere because I can hover and I can go forward relatively fast. Okay, here's the loading part. I'm gonna switch my flight mode and not touch anything and hopefully it doesn't crash. Please don't crash program. We wanna see this ship. Okay, we are waiting for it to load. Ah, crashed. All right, so I think it's loading now. I had to restart the game and rebuild, not rebuild, but load the mission and then test the mission inside the game. Hopefully it doesn't crash. Uh-oh. Oh! All right, it loaded. All right, so this is ship I was trying to load. This is by Beta SVK, and this is a Wasp-class wasp carrier, I believe. I don't think the actual name is a Wasp. I think it's a Wasp class. I might be wrong. I had a lot of trouble loading this, so it finally loaded, so I'm going to be very careful and see if we can take a look around the ship. It is a work in progress, and it is in normal mode, but how do I get on? I'm afraid to go in the water that I won't be able to climb back on. I don't think I can jump. Can I jump across this? Let's go. Ready? One, two, three. Go. Oh, no, I didn't make it. Looks like there is a door here. Oh, can I get in here? Oh, good, it works. Again, we're in, I think we're in advanced mode, so didn't think it might work. Wow, look at that. Okay, if I can just, really, I can't get in. You're not gonna go any lower than that? Seriously? Oh dear. All right, maybe can, oh no, no, come on. Come on. Oh dear. All right. So. Oh. oh wait. There's a ladder. Whew. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Here we go. All right. So this is the back of the ship that we're entering, and it's got a nice look. It looks like what I remember the aircraft carrier, the Enterprise, the, the roof. The only thing that's missing down here is like the little divots that they have in the aircraft carrier. I think it's for like tying things down or something. But this is huge. Again, this is a work in progress. So. It still doesn't have all the details. I'm actually having trouble climbing here. It's kind of odd. I can't climb up these slopes. Might be the game acting up. But there we go. So all right, so we got up here. Let's see if we can get to the deck or the bridge. The deck and the bridge? I don't know. Let's just try to get up. So he said he's been adding interior and a lot of details. Wow, oh, look at this. It's got little... Uh, what do you call those? Like little trolley cars or little, um, oh, I don't know. They're for the planes, to move the planes around and boxes and stuff. Like this is a forklift, but I think these are like little, uh, I don't know what the name are, but they look cool. And we've got the side here, which, oh, do these work? I don't know if it'll work if it's not in real mode here. Let's see. Oh my God, the elevators work. All right, let's go up on the elevator. So this is not one-to-one -one and it's still huge. Can you imagine a one-to-one? -one? Holy moly, Batman. All right, how do we get up? Can we not push a button while we're out here? Looks like we can't. Okay, can I run and jump on this thing? Let's try it. Huh. Oh, I guess you have to push the other button. Okay, let's push the other button. Huh. Oh, crap. Okay, I'm just gonna have to be very, like, stealthy. Like, push and jump to the right. Wait, what? Uh, stealthy jump, stealthy jump, stealthy jump. Ah, uh, uh. oh, <laughs> stealth jump! Yay! Okay, so now we are headed towards the deck of the ship, and this is where the aircraft will launch and land from. And it looks. Look at this. It's one of those times when I have to say this looks amazing. Look at the detail. The radars are moving. The radars. Oh wow! Look at that. And this is again. This is arcade mode, and I'm walking around in advanced mode. I think. And it looks amazing still. So can you imagine if <laughs> this thing could be in advanced mode and landing jets? Oh my gosh. Beware of jet blast and rotors. Wow. Okay, let's go ahead and see if we can go this way. No? This way? Yes. All right, so this is just a dark ship no matter what. Okay, so we're going to come inside here and see if we can walk around. And I have no idea how much detail is in this boat yet. Or sorry, this ship, not boat. This is a ship. So, okay, so we can't go. I don't know if these are like locked doors because there's nothing behind them yet. Or they're just for looks, just kind of prop doors. Okay, 
Let's head towards the bridge, maybe? Uh, what's down here? Um, okay. This is huge. I bet we can get back to the bottom hangar this way. Oh, oh I'm going to get lost in here, aren't I? Wait, this goes down more? <gasps> oh my gosh. This is crazy. Okay, we're going to go... Okay. Oh, okay, we're in here again. All right, that's cool. But wait, there's more! We can go down even farther. This is a crazy ship. Can you imagine if you had paintball in the game? Be like, oh, I'm at the bottom. Paintball. Oh, now we're down here. Okay, that's cool. So, does it go down any further? No, it doesn't. Okay, let's go up. Um, I'm afraid this game is going to crash while I'm doing this, so I'm kind of trying to get around the ship before it stops loading. <laughs> or before it stops working. So let's go ahead and go up all the way. Okay. Some issues with the stairs. I'm not sure what's going on there. I get kind of like stuck right here. The game is kind of freaking out there. Okay, let's kind of jump. And we're moving. Okay. So now we're back up again. Let's see if we can go even higher and get to the bridge. Oh, okay. This looks like a bridge. Oh, okay. So does this work? I don't think this works, right? Because I'm not in arcade mode. Does that work? Wow, it works. I didn't think arcade mode worked in uh, advanced mode. Interesting. All right, so let's take a look at the ship from the outside. Wow. Well, there you go. There is a lot of detail on the ship, and it's just beautiful. All right, so as you can see, this thing is huge, and it's even... I can't believe it's working in advanced mode. That's amazing. But we're going to go ahead and just try to take a look around and see if we can find anything else. I don't know where to look in this thing. But we have all the radars up there. Can we get up there? I don't even know. Let's see here. I'm just kind of walking around at random. Looks like that should be an observation deck of some sort. Oh, can we go higher? Let's go higher! All right. This is where the radar is. Can we go up? Oh! Let's try that again. I think we can go even a little bit more higher. A little bit higher. I'm going to go to the right this time. All right. And go up the ladder here. I feel like I'm mountain climbing. I'm going to go right again. Boop. All right. Any more high? Oh my gosh, we can go even higher. All right, we're going to go to the top of this ship. That's like a goal here. Okay. That's it? Is that it? I can't get any higher. All right, so where am I? Let's see. So I can't get up there, but I'm pretty high. That's pretty cool. All right, very cool. So let's, let's dive back down. I want to go and check out the guns back here. So I think... I'm not positive, but I think... Like that is an AA gun that's not quite finished. I'm not too sure about these parts here. I'm not familiar with aircraft parts, but uh, there's a lot of detail here with just the, the nets on the side here. I think that's for catching planes trying to fall off into the water or something. This looks like another thing that might be a gun or something. I'm not positive. But even the deck has all the artwork on it. And uh, I feel like I want to land an airplane on this, but I'm afraid I just can't spawn um, this ship and an airplane at the same time right now. So I'm lucky enough I got it started, and I'm very happy with that. I got to show you what it looks like. It is a work in progress, and hopefully both Stormworks and this ship are able to be updated and play together nicely so we can have some fun because this is awesome. This is this looks one-to-one -to, -one to me. He says it's not one-to-one. -one. It looks one-to-one. -one. Beta, if this is one-to-one, -one, let me know. I thought for sure you said it was not one-to-one. -one. But it looks huge. Love this thing. Okay, how do I get in the boat? I'm going to fall into the water, aren't I? I'm going to be mad. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to... This is not the right way to go. But I'm going to do it. Ready? One, two, three. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, there we go. Woohoo! So how actually do you get in here? I don't... I don't know. I don't see a good place to get in here. Look at that. It has the ropes or the wenches, whatever. 
to lower it. But this looks cool. Look, it has little engines. Oh, I wonder, wonder if I can get this to work. Let's see here. Let's see. Toggle button. Lights. I don't know what that is. That's a motor. How do we lower this thing? I don't see any way to get this down. It must be somewhere else. Yeah, I don't see a way to do it. Uh-oh. I think I'm actually stuck here now. Is there any way out of here? Uh-oh. All right, well, that's it for today. This has been the Wasp by Beta SVK. And also, you can go ahead and go ahead and click the link below and go to the workshop and subscribe so when he releases this thing, because it's a work in progress, you'll be one of the first to download it. But right now, you can also go ahead and try out his other vehicles, the Hercules Tugboat and the Lucky Helicopter. Uh, thanks for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Dramatic sell-by! No!